trying to work the wide body was uh, kind of a pain in the ass so what is up guys welcome back to the vlog so today's gonna be the day that we start the wide body camry that we have in shop before we actually start wrapping anything on the car we do have to do some light body work on it there are some cracks in the bondo basically we're gonna go ahead and do them and sand this all down make it even and we're gonna go ahead and put a new layer of bondo as i said first we're gonna go ahead and sand it we'll mix up some bondo and then we'll go ahead and take care of this What is up guys, so I just finished up the driver's side quarter panel and fender. So as you guys can see, it looks a lot better. There's no more cracks or anything like that. I did also have to sand um, up here on the quarter panel. Reason why is because whoever bonded it and when they had sprayed the primer, there was a bunch of primer all the way up here. So I went ahead and sanded everything, made sure it was smooth. So first things first, I'm gonna go ahead and prep it, get all the uh, dust off from the sanding and we're gonna go ahead and get this ready to be laid. Once that's finished up, we're gonna go ahead and uh, start off with the doors and then we'll go ahead and move on to the quarter panels. The quarter panel itself is gonna take a little bit longer just because of this big uh, wide body on it. I do wanna take my time on this. I wanna make sure everything is nice and neat. I have about two to three days with it to get a full color change. You guys can see my gummy bears. Gummy bears are gonna get me through the day. But other than that, guys, let's go ahead and uh, get this prepped and let's start wrapping. Before we start cleaning it, I am gonna go ahead and uh, change into a cleaner pair of clothes. Thank goodness I brought some. Reason why is because I do have a bunch of dust from sanding. So I'm gonna go ahead and change real quick and I'll bring you guys right back. All right guys, so freshly changed. Um, shout out to Paint Is Dead for sending me this out. Also Five Star Enterprises, thank you guys for getting into contact with me. And big shout out to the gloves that you guys sent out to me. I use them almost every vehicle that I wrap. So with that being said, I've um, got a fresh pair of clothes on. Gonna go ahead and start prepping everything, get all the dust that we caused from the sanding. And yeah, let's go ahead and start wrapping this thing. All right guys, so I just finished up the uh, quarter panel on the camera. Everything came out really, really good. Um, it took me a lot longer than I expected. I have about three and a half hours, four hours into the quarter panel. Trying to work, uh, trying to work, I can't even talk. Trying to work the wide body was uh, kind of a pain in the ass. So that itself took me about an hour, hour and a half. And then I also did take everything into the door. So this is one good thing. Um, I see a lot of installers actually lay both doors and the quarter panel all in one piece. I definitely do not recommend it. Reason why is because when you close the door, you can't eliminate all of the color inside like I did with this quarter panel. It's about 11.30. I'm gonna go ahead and try to get as far as I can on this car without pushing myself. But I do plan on knocking out this whole side, or at least the two doors. But I'm gonna go ahead and set you guys up a tripod, get these ones prepped, and let's go ahead and knock this one out. All right guys, so I just finished up the back door to the Camry. Everything looks really, really good. 
It is 2.30 in the morning, so I'm quite burnt out. I'm going to go ahead and hold off onto the Camry for tomorrow. I'll come in tomorrow morning. We're gonna go ahead and sand off all the Bondo that I put on the passenger side. Get everything blended in very good so, so we can start wrapping the rest of the car. My main goal for tomorrow would be to knock out the front and rear bumper along with the full passenger side. So this way on Sunday we can come in, we'll knock out the trunk, roof, and then the hood along with all the little things like the wing, the door handles, and the mirrors. But other than that guys, I'm burnt out. I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to go ahead and get home, get some rest, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace. What is up guys, welcome back to the vlog. So today is day two on the Camry. I already went ahead and pulled the Camry outside. Camry looks really, really good. Yesterday we were here until about two, three o'clock in the morning. So we did end up finishing the quarter panel and the back two doors. I'm not the back two doors, the uh, two doors on the driver's side. I'm about to go ahead and finish up all the sanding on the passenger side. As I said yesterday, or as you guys seen me do, we did end up bondoing some cracks that were on the uh, fenders. So the bond is fully cured, it's ready to be sanded. Once the sanding's fully finished, we can actually go ahead and prep the whole car, get everything clay part, uh, clay part, get everything clay barred, get everything ready and prepped, and we can go ahead and start finishing a majority of the car. Today, uh, my main goal is to go ahead and finish up the front rear bumper and the quarter panel on these two doors. Love to get the uh, two fenders done so, so we can come in tomorrow. Just knock out the roof, trunk, and hood. All the other little things like the wing and uh, door handles as well. So I just did the final wipe down on the Camry. The Camry is fully put together, fully finished. Looks very, very good. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick walk around before the owner gets here. He is on his way, but the car looks very good. A lot better than what it did. We also did throw uh, one of my red banners up top. But yeah, car looks really, really good. Uh, as soon as the owner gets here, I'll bring the camera back out and I'll go ahead and get the car leaving. But I'll see you guys then.